So, so how can we resonate? We know that you want to play golf again without back pain. But with not enough hours in the day, it can be difficult to find the time in the day to get it looked at. Not to mention, there are as many options out there to get relief. It's difficult to know which one to choose for the best. I've just knocked over 8 out of 10 people in a heartbeat who are thinking, when people, when people find my videos, my, my stuff that I put out, obviously I get that reaction. Probably get a lot of it. Um, but I also get a lot of, you just seem to get me. You seem to say something in those videos which get me. And that is my goal. As I put the videos out, as I listen to what people say, I take sections of what I do to put out to resonate with somebody in a way that makes them think this guy gets me. So in this context here, you could, you could rewrite that for whatever way that you want. Um, I know how you feel. We understand how frustrating it can be that you have to go out and network or that you want to come and see me and you'd like to go in network, but I'm a cash-based business owner. That's that initial reson I'm resonating with you now. But to take it one step further, uh, hey, listen, we know that you want to be able to work with your grandkids again, but with not enough hours in the day. So what am I, what am I playing on there? What's everybody in the world think that they are? Too busy. So I'm resonating with that lady now to go, this person understands that I'm too busy for this. It can be difficult to find the time in the day to get it looked at. Because how many conversations will be going on right now with a 20-year-old, 30-year-old, 40-year-old, 50-year-old telling their friends, telling their mother, telling their father, I'm just too busy. I'd like to, I, I know. Their friends will be nudging them every day saying, you should go and get that looked at. I know, but I'm too busy. Got the kids, got the house, got the dogs, got the whatever. So that's how we resonate with those people. Not to mention, there are so many options out there to get relief, it's difficult to know which one to choose for the best. Probably in that last sentence, I've completely summed up eight out of 10 people's real issue. There are so many people out there promising the same transformation as you. You are now in a rat race and it will get harder, particularly for the unlicensed um, professions who can pretty much say what they want and promise anything and do anything. As you, um, as you encounter that, you're gonna have to get even cleverer with your messaging and, and factor that in. And that's what, that will factor that in, that type of conversation. Hey, uh, hey Mary, listen, I know, I know that you're confused right now. There's so many options out there. I mean, take one look on YouTube. If you've, did you Google back pain before you took my free report? Yes, I did. And how many different options came up? Oh, well, about 17. That right there has just started a, if I got to that, and here's how confident I would be, if I got to that point with a patient, at that level, within 30 or 40 seconds, eight out of 10 of them would be a customer. Guarantee it. Because this person understands me. This person gets me. This person's not selling. This person understands me. He knows I'm too busy. He knows I'm confused. And he knows that there are so many options out there, I just don't know which one to choose. Those three things alone sum up 80% of this world in any profession. So whether this is doctor, whether this is dentist, whether this is pool cleaner, hey, with all of the different options out there, you just don't know which stuff to put in your pool, do you? Nope. You know, if you've got them two kids, the last thing that you want to be doing is putting people into a pool. Yeah, and you're not quite sure of the chemicals that you're putting in. That's right. So what have you done? Well, we've left the pool empty for the last 18 months. What have you done? Well, we've left, I haven't done anything about my back pain in the last 18 months. See the structure and the mechanics of it? Ultimately, it's the same challenge for every human being trying to make a decision. So let's write some empathetic statements that you can use to open your follow-up conversations. And then let's go around the room. So what could you think about now your perfect patient? What could we use? And here's what I would, would challenge you to do. If you're up for it, if you're up for it, if you've done follow-up conversations, write down what you've started with. Write down what's currently being said, and then we'll look at what we can take this to. Thanks for watching this video, and if you found it helpful, and if you now find yourself thinking, I wonder what else this person can help me with, head over to paulgoff.com forward slash books, where you can find my best-selling books, which will show you how to add more profit to your practice. Or send an email to paul at paulgoff.com to ask about how we can help you accelerate the growth and profitability of your clinic. And by the way, if you know anybody who would find this helpful, please share this video out. Thanks so much.